What's going on Spartans? Welcome back. This is a world domination hacking and cheating video. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about it. Uh, the truth of hacking and cheating. What is real? What is not? And I'm going to tell you guys some really cool glitches that you might consider cheats but are not illegal according to the game makers. Um, I'll also be going over a lot of gameplay so you're going to see me just playing along and stuff. You can watch as you go. I might commentate a little bit but for the most part I'm going to focus on giving you guys a huge warning. Do not click on any video or website that shows this hacks.com or anything like that because guys these are not real big warning these are fake do not click on them a lot of them really just want you to go ahead and download an app onto your computer so they can give you a virus or take your information and the main thing is guys you do not want your information being stolen either willingly or unwillingly and sold to other companies and you definitely don't want a virus on your computer because that can cause you a lot of issues so do not do anything that has involved uh, computers and definitely don't even try and do it on your phone guys. It's pointless. What's the point of hacking and cheating? Um, there's real no point but guys there are real cheats or glitches inside the game or things that you can do that most people don't know about that is really really cool and I'll kind of try and get them to happen in this gameplay and I'll jump to parts and show you them. I actually had it happen in a video I just did so let me go ahead and jump to that part right now. As you can see I already have about eight guys on this pad or nine guys on this pad right here I can't really tell and I just revived a tenth person it looks like another surgeon so if you have a surgeon on a one pad three pad or five pad as long as troops already die in that pad you can actually fill the pad up real quick uh, with the surgeon you put down and it'll say five people have filled this pad but then she'll still continue to revive people that have died in the past on that area so super useful little cheat or trick inside the game and it's really helpful guys especially if there's only a one or three pad in front of the hospital you can really really use this to your advantage as long as you distract the troops and pull them away and I'll show a whole video on that I actually made one in the past on it and if you want to see old gameplay I showed it I'll show that on screen right now but guys as I said this on screen the world's domination hacks or huge hacks or whatever the hell it is it's all fake do not do not do these I don't want you guys cause any issues for yourself um, it's so stupid but guys the real ones inside the game are possible for example there are also different strategies you can use that allow you to build your troops up in the back and I will show those strategies soon I'll make a video for them um, I was gonna put this on world domination expert I'm thinking I'm gonna put this on my king channel I may post this also on the world domination expert in the future but I really really want to get the message out guys I don't want people getting in trouble and I definitely don't want them causing issues for themselves at home um, Big things, if you want free stuff, we're going to be doing giveaways on my channel, World Zombination Expert channel, and if you want free stuff inside the game, we'll be doing that too, so definitely stay subscribed, keep watching, because we're going to be giving stuff away, and I will also continue to bring out glitches, cheats, and hacks that I find, however, I will warn you right now, there will never be a hack, because this is a private server game, and hacks are not really possible on these kind of games, so hacking and real cheating... They're, they're really not possible. I mean, little little cheats and glitches like the one I showed you with the surgeon, those are completely possible and real. But, like, getting unlimited resources, not possible. Um, it was possible in Clash of Clans in basically a sandbox mode, but it wasn't real, guys. It was offline. And as soon as you go back online, it connects to the server and erases all that information, so it was pointless. The only, people did, uh, the only reason people did it was because they were able to see their defenses upgrade all the way to max. And then after that, as soon as you log online, it puts all your defenses back to normal and they look like crap again. So, I mean, some people did it to see what defenses would look like maxed out and see what their base would look like maxed out. And you know what? Good for them, I guess. Have fun if you want. But there's no point in doing it in this game and there's no way to do it in this game because you can't, like, max anything out. Because you can max out your, your troops to level 50, but guess what? You can't do an attack offline. You have to be online to do an attack. And there's where the issue is. So there's no way to hack or cheat, guys. I want to explain that and explain why people are like, oh, there's probably hacks and cheats in Clash of Clans. They're not. There's none. And uh, I know I'm kind of ranting, guys, but it's a really big issue and people are stupid to even try because it can cause, as I said, definitely huge problems, including viruses or information being stolen off your computer. But, guys, enough of that. Enough ranting. What I will say is if you want to see little glitches and cheats and fun things like that, definitely stay tuned to World Zombination Expert and my channel, King24412. And I'll definitely be having plenty of those up because I always find them and I always have fun doing them. 
Now, the best part about my glitch videos or cheat videos that I will be posting will be that none of them will actually cause the game or you issues. They'll basically just be little tricks and little things that are glitches inside the game that can be used to help you out. And of course, I will never promote anything that would hurt you or as the player or even the game because I want both to be successful and I definitely don't want to ruin the game in any way. So do not ever be worried about any of the videos I post. Um, obviously, they're going to be clean in any way possible. Now, as you can see, I do have a decently built up pad down here. And I'm just continuing to drop troops if there is a sacrifice so I can build up these pads. And as soon as that surgeon comes alive, I'll boost her down there and she'll be fine. Oh my god, just kill him. Come on, Moltoff, do it. Now, I got a surgeon here we can drop. Alright, guys. Oh, man, I'm being attacked in Plunder Pirates. Oh, I hate that, guys. The notification system sucks. It just basically wants to rub in the fact that you're not playing every game at once. Like, oh, guess what? You logged out of the Clash for three seconds. You're being destroyed. Or wait, Plunder Pirates is also being attacked. Congratulations. Like, what? Why? All right, anyway. Not really a big deal, guys. But anyway, we did win this one. The next raid we have here will be a Surging Glitch one, which will show how to use it properly. It'll show two strategies, and I'll be explaining them in depth. And then after that, I'll have one more entire attack for you guys that you can do whatever you want with. I'm not going to commentate the third one. I'm just going to commentate this one really well, and then we're going to cut it. I'm having huge issues with my iMovie. I really want to complain to Apple, but I know there's really nothing they can do. There's working on the iMovie settings, and iMovie's kind of messing up. But anyway, not really that big a deal, just kind of a big headache because it keeps quitting on me and erasing all my work. Anywho, we're going to let it go. And as you can see, there's only a one pad in front of the hospital, and that's terrible news. Now, there is a five pad that leads toward it, but guys, there's three purple pads that are going to have that five pad. So we need an undying pad or an invincible pad, and that's going to be what we do with our surgeon. Now, what we're going to do is actually build up that five pad up top there, because there is a five pad in front of that single purple pad, and we want that to be really strong. We don't want to worry about that entire area at all, because we cannot defend from two directions continuously. So we're going to build that one real strong, throw the machine gun on the five pad here, and then... We're going to start this battle, actually. Save our surgeon, save our fire chief for distraction purposes. Now, once all these zombies come out, we're going to give them a second or two. And dropped them. Now, what we're going to wait for, guys, to drop our surgeon is we're waiting for our machine gunner to get activated here. And you're going to see that by him going on one knee. That means he's starting to load his machine gun up and he's going to release health. So he went down on one knee, so we dropped our surgeon, revived that other fire chief. She dies, though. Set a second fire chief down. And now we have regened enough troops to protect our actual machine gunner. So pretty solid here. Did a good job of this. Unfortunately, a puddler does ruin it here in a second. And yeah, that puddler really did screw us. It hit the machine gunner and the scatter shots and destroyed them. So we're going to reset the whole thing, guys. And as you can see, just get to drag all these troops over here to the right pad. And then hopefully, if we get real lucky, we can split them up, which we just did. And now we can kill this little horde of drones with a couple scatter shots, and now we get a scatter shot machine gunner and a surgeon down. The surgeon's not doing anything, guys. I'm really not happy about this. The surgeon's just sitting there. Look at her. She's doing nothing. What the hell, guys? Oh, my God. I even boosted her. She didn't do anything. Now, this is the glitch that I should have known better on. There is another glitch inside the game where the surgeon doesn't actually do anything. She kind of just sits there and acts stupid, and this is really bad news. Um, she's such a strong troop. But look, she's doing nothing once again. So sometimes this happens, and what you do is you, you can just actually move her on the pad. And then she starts moving and doing things, which is really crazy. Look how fast she's actually, like, pulling troops alive. Like, every two seconds, three seconds, there's another troop being pulled alive. So we're going to let her do her job, and she's going to do quite a good job at it. She's just responding. Look at that. Six people already pulled alive. We're going to keep distracting these zombies. Seven people. Come on, keep going. Eight people. All right. And now another machine gunner. It looks like we got nine people revived. Nice, nice. And then she's going to pull up the last one, which is the 10th one. A new Surgeon. Boom. So, solid win. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more. If you want to go ahead and watch this last attack I did, go ahead. I'm going to stop commentating, though, because my iMovie is giving me really big troubles. I literally, oh my god, I don't want to talk about it. I'm just getting really irritated. Um, it's quit out about 35 times in this video. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Thanks so much. Love you guys. I will see you guys very, very soon. Peace. Spinning up. Timber! Action!
us. And ye shall receive. Measure twice, cut once. Come closer. Pull. X and ye shall receive. Over and out. I'm a cold, dead hands. It's spreading. Juicy. Lord of gas. Lock and load. Yippee-ki-yay. Pull. Measure twice, cut one. Over and out. Come closer. Juicy. Spinning up. Boom! Ready! Caught in the crossfire! Lock and load! Clean up on aisle three! I still got a leg! Pull! X and ye shall receive! It's spreading! Over and out! Come closer. Timber! Boom! X and ye shall receive! Yippee-ki-yay! Spinning up. Measure twice, cut one. But I'm just an in. X and ye shall receive! Pull! Over and out! Timber! Zombie season is open! Boom! Clean up on aisle three. 